In this video, we're going to go visit La Conchita Landslide. La Conchita is located in Southern California. If we zoom in, we can see that La Conchita is located too far. Let's see, located uh, between Carpinteria and here's Ventura along Highway uh, 1, Pacific Coast Highway. If we continue to zoom in, you may have seen La Conchita um, from the highway if you've gone north and not really taken too much note of it. The La Conchita has a very small town here, and uh, you may have noticed um, over on this side of the beach is where there's some RVs that are parked. But there's this cute little village here, this town, La Conchita. And up on the hillside is where uh, there's a uh, two large massive landslides. So let's go check it out. I'm standing here at La Cachita Landslide, just off of the Pacific Coast Highway. And what you can see behind us is uh, a landslide that happened in 1995, as well as 2005. This is an image of the 1995 La Cachita Landslide. And uh, so you can see in this picture here that the landslide came down into the community of La Cachita, probably impacted some of these homes right here. If we look at the shape of the landslide, here's roughly where that entire mass came down from the hillside. And you can see that this is where we get that bowl shape, that concave shape right here. Um, in the slide in 1995 prompted the County of Ventura to declare this area, this community, a geological hazard area, and that there's been evidence um, of landslides that have occurred thousands of years here in the past. So this area is very prone to um, slides due to intense ra rainfalls. Now this picture is from 2005, uh, La Conchita landslide. And in this one, you can really see how the landslide came down and really came into the city here of La Conchita, how these were all homes. And this was uh, a bit more destructive in that it killed about 10 people and destroyed about a dozen homes. Um, again, here's the outline of that entire landslide. And again, we get that bowl shape of the earth coming down in, in one large mass. So in 2005, there were lawsuits over this slide that were uh, between the homeowners and the owners of the avocado ranch that is above the community of La Conchita. The community said that the ranch didn't provide adequate drainage for its orchards during this torrential rain. And three years after the landslide, the ranch turned over all of its 700 acres and assets to settle the suit. So um, this area has been known for having lots of landslides and due to heavy rains and poor drainage, uh, that was determined for part of the reason why this landslide occurred in 2005. And when we talk about landslides, uh, we talk about it's either creeping or there's a slump. And the slump is one large mass that goes with the entire earth. And so we see the slump behind us and it, it creates this like bowl like where the whole side of the hillside just completely slumps down in one large mass. And it looks, it has this, this bowl shape to it. You can see that if you come here to La Conchita, you can see where those little bowl shapes are. And, uh, and you can see that here on the hillside, even though it's been many years since the last landslide occurred. And when we had the Thomas fires, this area was under, um, was under investigation because we had all that dry hillside and then that severe rainfall resulted in the Montecito debris flows just north of us where we are. But this area is prone to landslides when we have large rainfall. And now it's deemed as a, an area of concern for geohazards. So if you were to buy property here, or if you were to buy a home here, the report would show that you'd be prone to landslides right in your backyard. And you can see that a lot of people still have their homes here. Um, and a lot of people rebuilt after the 2005 landslide. It's a little hard to see from right here on the ground, but it's much easier to see from the air.